As promised, here's the video update when we knew more information about the new Zwift route. Well, it is out, it's available, you can go and ride it if you're past level 10 because it does come off the jungle route. It is Alpe d'Huez. But unfortunately, like a lot of uh, updates that come out from Zwift, I happen to be elsewhere on the day they drop. So it's up to everybody else to jump on Zwift, do the update, do the ride, and let me know what it's all about. The stats that I have that I've pulled off ZwiftInsider.com, I'll link below to that. Eric does some great work over there. We have 1036 meters of climbing, so just over a thousand meters of climbing, which is 3,400 feet, 12 kilometers in length, 7.5 miles, with an average gradient of 9%. Now, Eric's got these uh, the stats off Eric Min's ride, another Eric, who leaked it out a few days ago on Strava. So, they're the details we know. I've also been told there's more than meets the eye when it comes to this climb. So, everybody's challenged because I'm elsewhere today and not on my Zwift station, that's back at home. Jump on there and let me know how it goes. Let me know, did you get to the top? What time did you post? And what are the special things at the top I've been told about? Here's a few sneak pictures I've been sent. But I can't really tell much until I get out there and ride. So again, over to you guys. Let me know how it goes. I'm keen to get home and ride this new route. Zwift has Alpe d'Huez. Can't wait for it. And in addition to what I've just spoken about, I've managed to get a live capture of my avatar completing the entire climb. Now I've sped this up because it is quite a long climb. So here it is in its entirety in only a minute. Now this is gonna take me over an hour to ride in real life. So just a quick look at what to expect and what's coming up. And I did note at the start, there was another start gate. So I'm not quite sure that's a level 10 because I'm a level 25, I get through the gate. Not quite sure if it's a level 10 thing, but we will know, I'll put it in the comments below what level you'll need to be to complete this climb. But enjoy the visuals that fly past very quickly.